Hey guys, that's a quick unboxing and review of the Commercial Electrics. This is a Home Depot brand. Uh, not necessarily the cheapest one, but I found them to to have always the always higher quali quality items compared to to other sometimes brand name items uh, at a very affordable price. The model number is 1006316039. This is a full motion TV wall mount for TVs of any size between 23 inches to 63 inches. Um, it shows um, it has uh, 180 degrees of swivel, positive 5 to 15 to negative 15 degrees. Um, uh, negative 15 degrees tilt. This tilt is like this it's not side to side it's like this so it goes vertically also support 77 uh, 77 pounds uh, on on three uh, on three bolted connections here um, the the product itself is very good it, it includes first of all it includes everything you need in order to mount your TV all that you need is right here. The only thing that you need, according to according to the manual, is um, power drill. So you can pre-drill your stud or your uh, concrete wall or your brick wall. Uh, you need a 532 um, drill, or that's four millimeter. That's wood drill bit, or depending on the man uh, or if you were installing it on the masonry 3 8 or 10 millimeter because you need to attach to attach anchor for for masonry wall you need a Phillips screwdriver stud finder measuring tape pencil hammer if you are need, if you need to hammer the uh, the anchors inside the uh, inside your masonry wall and you need a socket socket tool that's all you need to to install that you don't need hdmi cable you have one provided this is a very good six feet hdmi cable it is very strong very strong very rigid very thick cables inside so they uh, they definitely do a good job um, i had Previously, I bought another HDMI cable from Commercial Electric, and those are really good. Uh, I'm glad that they sent one um, one included in this kit because I can definitely find use for for another one. And uh, cables of such quality like this one usually are more more expensive. They're not just your usual type of uh, you know five dollar HDMI cable. So that's that's very good. Um, the product description itself um, is on the box. It shows every dimension that you can uh, that you can possibly be interested in. Let me try to zoom that in. So as you see, maximum extension is uh, uh, forty-two centimeters, or it translates to almost sixteen and three quarters inches spans uh spans between now this is i'll get back to this uh basically because it serves such a wide variety of tvs <clears throat> it has a back plate for for certain size uh size and brand of tvs like this and then for larger <clears throat> for larger screens it has uh separate it has those separate brackets that you have to install like those brackets that you have to install that you have to install on the back plate like this you have to install and have a wider let me zoom out and have a wider um, have a wider area to install to install the TV that works for that works for TVs that are usually above uh, above uh, 55 inches um, sometimes they have this although some brands would just have this uh this standard size uh, this works on um a lot of vizios uh philips lg um, they definitely cover a lot of uh, a lot of models so let me try to zoom that in 
So maximum is uh, 15 inches and three quarters or 400 millimeters, 40 centimeters here, uh, hole to hole, hole to hole. Square dimensions here to there, so they are matching. The profile, the minimal profile is uh, 6.69 millimeters or 6.9. 6.9 centimeters which translates to about 7 centimeters or 2 and almost 3 quarters of inches uh, that depends on the tilt now if you tilt it more then obviously your your top uh, top opening would be more than your bottom one so you can do that tilt between positive 5 to minus 15 15 degrees. Uh, basically, you don't need more than um, 7.5, 8.5 uh, degrees of tilt. Although in some in some occasions you may need you may need more. Like if you are putting it way up high, like on an airport, you need to use like the 15 degree tilt. Again, maximum extended is 16.69 inches. Now it shows uh, VESA standards. This is the all the TVs right now that are on sale are on VESA standards. They those are flat uh, flat screen TVs, 7500, 200, 300, 400 standard. Supports supports 77 pounds of uh, of weight. This is distributed on three on three uh, three load bearing points on three studs uh, on three bolts that you bolt on the stud extend the distance again 16.69 inches swivel 90 degrees to 90 degrees all hardware is included including magnetic bubble level why is that important let me show you a lot of times a lot of times when you when you haven't installed that in the past and like myself, I haven't installed that in the past. It is critical that you don't install you install this horizontally, not tilted like this, but it has to be level. And that's when your magnetic your magnetic level comes handy. And that's included in the hardware right here. And you can use though you can use this for quite a large variety of quite a large, large variety of subsequent tasks so you can use this like this here it's magnetic and basically you put it here on the top and you make sure that that's how you make sure that you haven't tilted the installation you have to find a stud with uh, with your stud finder you have to find a stud and then attach this this and this and you see how, how easy they designed it. Like you have this wider hole here, you install the one here, you install, you pre-drill the hole here, and that's all you need. Uh, then you make sure that it is level. It is it is very easy with it is very easy with uh, with this bubble to make sure that this is level, it's not tilted like this or that, that it's very that it is very level. And once you're done, once you're done, you just have to mark your hole right here and then pre-drill pre those two and attach attach that to the wall with with those. Now they seem very sturdy. Quite a large, quite a large bolt, about two inches. Um, and that bears uh, so that bears uh, what 20 close to one of those bears 25 pounds more than enough to to carry not more than 25 pounds each one of them so the whole point is that you have to find uh, in the wall you have to find uh, a stud where you are where you affix that alternatively you can use those with anchors on a masonry wall on concrete you have all the hardware that you possibly may need included here in this kit. 
you have also um, you have also straps for the HDMI cable, uh, Velcro straps, so you you keep it uh, out of sight. Out of sight, will tuck tuck behind the TV. You have four four extension brackets that you need to that you need in order to mount uh, to mount the 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 back plate for you need to mount the back plate for uh, for larger TVs. And the way they did it, it's it fits. Actually, I haven't found found the brand that's uh, that sold sold right now in the in the US that this does not fit I've installed um, at least 25 of those and um, different places and every time if it if the bracket itself is too narrow which fits most I should say most TV brands just with a bracket bigger TVs you can just fit that and they have pre-drilled uh, pre holes uh, holes uh, here for different different types of uh, different types of TVs, and sometimes they work. This, I can tell you this this would work on on a larger diameter of TVs. This would work up to seventy something, but they bear responsibility. The manufacturer bears responsibility only up to sixty three inches. Um, usually, a larger TVs that's that's mostly because of load bearing. So load bearing is critical. They have no responsibilities for loads above 70, uh, 77 pounds. The thing is, modern TVs are well below 77 pounds. Even those that are above 70 inches in diameter, like um, anything above like 65 inches, they are definitely not more than 77 pounds. So this has the capacity to this has the capacity to uh, to be installed with the uh, with a wider bigger TV but again you have to be mindful about the about the the load bearing capacity and this is uh, this is rated uh, for 77 77 pounds and you can see it on the label itself uh, this is a product that's made in Vietnam um, they have a manufacturing date and max load weight 77 pounds or 35 kilograms I would say that I can load three times as much weight on that without tilting, without anything. Now this is built so sturdy. It's like everything is so sturdy, like thicker metal all around. All around. Very good, very good. Uh, um, just by the looks of it, this is powder coated. Uh, very well built. very thick now the back plane that's usually this is not this does not have a lot of load bearing but this is really thick i can't i can't even i can't even bend it just a little bit with my fingers with all my strength i can't this is just very thick i don't know what the thickness is but it is a very very thick very thick metal so if you mess something up and you need to make a finer adjustment this is of your tilt this is how you do it from here you loosen those two bolts and you can tilt it from here just uh, you can adjust it right from here right from here other than that that's your that's your minimal dimension right there your TV will stand out from the wall just like this. This cannot swivel on its own. And if it's too tight, you have to put a little bit of oil here on all the connections, wipe it so it doesn't drip, and then it will be a little bit looser. If it's too loose, then you just need to, to tighten this connection and that's it. Or this one, depending on which one is loose. So very good, uh, very good design. Um, that's how you tilt it from here. You unscrew this and you tilt it back and forth. Um, very good design. Very simple, simple and sturdy design. This was designed with one uh, one idea in mind: to be sturdy, to um, be able to carry a lot of big load, to carry. Uh, 
quite uh, heavy TV has markings everywhere how to install it the uh, the installation manual itself uh, the installation manual itself is very detailed it includes different kind of spacers washers uh, uh, for installation for different TV types uh, now some some TVs would uh, some TVs would uh, work with let's say M4 bolts or some others would work with M6 others would require M8 like larger bolts and you need those in order to install that so again the the entire kit comes complete with everything all the hardware that you need all you need is a stud finder drill and um, a couple of drill bits basically that's it and um, again this is a very sturdy sturdy piece that comes on the market uh, I wanted to show you this the way how this has been done this is a friction friction type of uh, friction type of connection where the metal extends a little bit and they drill the drill the you know the threads right there on the extension this is a very good um, for for normal load bearing points it's a very good very good design um, I believe it's a very good piece of um, very good piece of equipment very sturdy uh, can support a lot of weight can support very good uh, in a very good way your TV um, again the installation is pretty straightforward there is a stencil provided um, to mark mark your points but if you don't want to use that that's absolutely okay you can just install it based off based on this it's like shooting from the hip but at the same time they allow for for you to be able to to adjust the tilt so it's nice and level um, very good sturdy steel does not flex, does not bend. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.